What's up everybody, it's your boy Chuck here, back with another video of Chuck Gaming from the official BeGameHere.com And I want to talk about the shooters that's coming out this year, man, we got some good ones coming out, man uh, It's, it's going to be a good, real good year for shooters and I'm not going to include Gears Remaster because it is a remaster, and we already know how people feel about remasters So we're going to pass on that one, even though it's going to be a good game, and I will be picking that up so uh, my gamer tag is I love money 365. Love is L U V because I'm from the nah. <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah, we got some bangers, man. We got four good shooters. Could be great shooters coming out this year. Um, I'm gonna start with uh, Rainbow Six. It got pushed back to December, but you know everybody knows Rainbow Six is basically a tactical shooter. Uh, similar to Counter-Strike, if you play Counter-Strike or familiar with it, Rainbow Six, man, they have many games in their franchise, and this one looks really good, man, destructible environments, uh, real tight environments where, you know, you gotta rescue the hostages and stuff like that, it should be fun with a team, and they also got terrorists hunt where you try to, you go against the CPU, which is good, so, um, I think... That's that's one on my radio. I'm definitely picking that one up. I love Rainbow Six. Tom Clancy always gets plus for me. I'm a Tom Clancy fanboy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, all right. So moving on, we gonna go to uh, Black Ops Three. I'm playing it right now. Nah, <laughs> nah. This is Titanfall. Yeah, that was a shot. Uh, nah, this is Titanfall, man. But uh, Black Ops Three, man. I haven't played it yet. I'm gonna play it next week. I wanna hit Xbox with the beta. It looks cool, man. I'm not gonna say it's bad. I'm not gonna say it's trash because I haven't played it yet. But from what I've seen, it looks decent. I'll give my final verdict next week. So look out for that. I will do a review on it um, or impressions video of it or whatever. So look out for that. But it looks decent from what I've seen so far. Uh, the, the superpowers are not too OP like I thought they would be. Um, there's a couple that may be in the future like the glitch and stuff like that but like I said once I test it out I can give you a, a better understanding of where I'm coming from uh, okay so we're gonna jump into Halo 5 which I believe will be the shooter of the year hands down uh, content galore single player is going to be excellent multiplayer has war zone now so it's kind of like it's what Titanfall was trying to do, but the AI in Halo 5 would be better in the, in the mode called Wars. I have AI enemies while you fighting the other uh, player control enemies too. So it's, it's going to be crazy, man. Big maps, big vehicles, Halo, and then they got the closed quarter arena shooter Halo 2, man. Halo 5, is, it runs smooth in my opinion. I, I had a blast with the beta in December, I believe. Yeah, it was in December, and I can't wait for the full game. I'm, I'm really pumped. Really pumped for Halo 5, man. I think Halo 5 is about to do damage this year, man. I, that's just me. And, uh, well, last but not least, man, this is one I'm kind of skeptical on. Um, for a couple of these, but, uh, Battlefront. Um, for one, I'm not really a Star Wars fan. I don't like lasers and stuff like that. Um, uh, I just, I don't know, man. I mean, it looks like that dog fight looks real good in this game. It looks like it could be fun. Um, yeah, so if you're a Star Wars fan, the game looks really good, though. Graphically, the game looks really good. And, uh, you know, but there's something about Battlefront that I, I can't, like, put my finger on, man. I don't know, man. Well, I'll get to play it through EA Access, <laughs> so I could, I could test out the full game before I even want to... You see if I want to put some money on that, but that's the only one I'm kind of skeptical on. And well, I'll say Black Ops 3 too. I haven't played it yet, I, you know. But shout out to the beta, that's cool too. I get to test that one out also. But yeah, so let me know what you guys think, man. Uh, what shooter out of the four I mentioned, I think it would be the best one this year. Me personally, I'm gonna go with Halo 5. I think Halo 5 is going to be the juggernaut game this year. Besides Fallout 4, I think it's going to be Halo 5. But anyway, man, make sure you guys go check out the website, officialgamehere.com. Uh, this is your boy, I'm Chuck Gaming from We Game Here, man. Hey, get at me, bruh. Get at me.